Hey there everyone, this is Danielle, uh, checking out Child of Light. Um, I just got this game on a card actually. Uh, I went into, you know, the, the shop and they had it like as a bundle deal where the same card had this game and also this one, Valley and Hearts the Great War. I'd never heard of that, but I've heard of Child of Light, it sounds pretty cool. Um, and it was like pretty cheap to get both of them. And they it's interesting that... <sighs> there. Oddly enough, there is actually one game card here, and they're both on the same card as separate games, so that's a thing you can do with the Switch, apparently, which is kind of cool. Um, anyway. We're gonna check out Child of Light for now. Um, I haven't actually played it. I saw it on the eShop a while ago, and I thought, oh, that's pretty cool, but I didn't actually try it. Um, so we're gonna try it now, we're gonna see how it goes. All right. Ubisoft. Um, apparently there's an epilepsy warning in this game, so you might want to be careful if you do, if you are photosensitive, um, because not all games do that these days, so this might indicate something a little more, uh, photosensitive than normal, if you get my gist, if you get my drift. Anyway, uh, here's the title screen. It's got some really gorgeous artwork here. And some really nice music, too. So that's pretty awesome. Um, let's head on in. This edition contains all the additional content that was released for Child of Light. Uh, additional mission, skins, oculi pack. Yeah, um, this is... It, the pack says Ultimate Edition. I think that means all, like, the DLC is built into it or whatever. So I think that's pretty much what we're seeing here. Uh, let's look at the options. Uh, there's a bunch of options here, that's pretty cool. I guess I'll leave these on the defaults, it should be fine. Uh, let's see how we go. New game. Um, let's go with casual for now, I might switch to expert later. Loading. Loading. Child, tuck yourself in bed and let me tell a story of Lemuria, a long lost kingdom and a girl born for glory. In Austria was a crown land ruled by a duke. Aurora was his daughter. Child of a duchess mysterious, beloved by her father. He raised the girl alone. They were rarely apart, till the duke felt lonely and misplaced his heart. It was the Great Friday before Easter 1895. Players performed for the duke, his new bride at his side. That night Aurora went to sleep, the fire burned down low. She caught a chill that spread. Her skin was cold as snow. At dawn they found her, vacant. Aurora's light gone out. Her father wept and pleaded, but there could be no doubt. For all intents and purposes, Aurora was dead. And yet, once upon a time, she awoke in a strange land instead. Oh, it's a pretty dark intro. Um, so this is set in real historical times. They gave a year on everything, so that's an interesting decision. I think I think it's the Sleeping Beauty story. What am I seeing? I must be dreaming. Because that's that's the name of the princess from that, and I think that one is Austrian. Ubisoft Presents. An Ubisoft Montreal production. Child of Light. Okay, so... Girl and the Firefly. Alright, well... 
Father! Wake me from this slumber. Okay, I can move using the analog stick or the uh, or the D-pad, but I seem to be a bit quicker, I think, if I use the analog, maybe? No, no, it's, di it's digital. It's only one speed of walking. Uh, you also turn around really slowly, which is strange. Um... Guess I'll go this way. I can jump with B. Uh... Guess I wasn't supposed to go this way. Alright. Um... I can also jump with A. A and B do the same thing by the looks of things. None of the other buttons seem to do anything yet. I should not do something soon, though. I guess I'll go this way? Oh, hang on. Y button. Right to the old monastery. Okay. Woods darker than night. Shadows lost of light. Can you push this along, I'm guessing? Yeah. The use of a 3D model for the princess and... Is she a princess or a... I mean, her parents were, were a duke and duchess, so... Uh, I guess she's also a duchess, I guess. I don't know how it works. Um, I can see a bunch of stuff in the background where it feels like I should be able... Yeah, I can walk up here. Okay. Yeah, using a 3D model for the for the um, for Aurora herself, and using hand drawn it looks hand drawn artwork for everything else it looks a little strange. She sort of looks out of place, but that might be intentional. The stream is formed of frigid air. Dark spirits fly. I know not where. Yeah, spider. That's scary. No, wake up. Wake up! Nightmare, let me wake! Oh no... Papa, where are you? My heart shall break. Should probably have an Austrian accent now I think about it. Oops. Will someone please explain how water falls with no rain? Who spoke? I did. Shake the dew from your eyes. The four mole grows, that's common sense. A firefly that speaks advice? My supper must have been too dense. <laughs> it rhymes. Food sounds good, but I am lost. Ever heard of an aurora? Why, sir, she is me! Both sir and she? A split aura. Perhaps you are some kind of flora. <laughs> Cease your foolishness at once. I am Aurora. I am she. Oh, why didn't you say so? Follow me. A lady waits. How long is a forest stream? With skin like moths and gleaming eyes. A seer. She'll know the way out of this dream. Okay, so the firefly is my friend now. Use the right stick to move the firefly. Okay. Can I just leave it? Will it follow me? Yeah. Okay, it's kind of like a... Kind of like a galaxy sort of pointer, I guess? That looks a bit scary in the background there. Oops. Ooh, what's this? Healing tonic. Open inventory menu. Plus. Okay, so I've got a health now. Or a healing tonic or whatever. I guess that'll come in handy. I don't get out of here. <laughs> um. Can I climb back up here? It's a little tricky seeing what's a platform and what's not. Okay, there we go. Can I use the firefly to help me across here? I don't think I can stand on it. Yeah. You gotta just jump better? Yeah, there we go. <laughs> what is tied to those branches? Curious charms, little hands fastened tight. Don't you know? Those are wishes. Wishes of light left in darkest night. Follow the orange one to find more. Bright. 
Okay, so... Witches taste delicious. Have a bite. Wait until I tell father about this night. Okay, so we want to collect these things. Okay, and that'd be health and MP I'm filling up when I do that. And also whatever that bar in my Firefly is. Can I get the Firefly to get them? Yes. So yeah, that's a bit like a Galaxy's Pointer, but you have to move it with the right stick instead. Uh, can I go in there? The path's right over this tree. But I cannot fly with thee. I cannot fly there with thee. Okay, so we can't actually go back there. Trapped, the door is barred. A scepter round, a translucent sphere. Clear as glass, the answer. So Firefly, ignite your rear. <laughs> Whoa, I barely know you. Do it and I'll show you. <laughs> These three scepters are shadow cast. Oh. We have to match the symbols fast. Hold ZL to make Firefly glow. Okay, and that uses up the Firefly bar. Oh, I see. I get it. Oh, that's a cool gimmick. I like that. So that goes there. Then this one goes in the middle. And then this one goes over there. So I need to... And then the door opens. So Firefly, our path is clear. But who would put a door here? I kind of want to keep going this way a little bit more. So one of these, so I can get some more. Orange blobos. Can't get up there, so I definitely have to go through the door next. Who was she, I wonder? Move the sword under. Who spoke? Some sort of ghost? The Lady of the Forest. I'm sure of this. Aurora, take the sword of Malthildus. Mathildis. Whatever it is. Okay, so I'm gonna get a sword now. It feels real. Look at it gleam. Run. That thing looks mean. Fortunately, I wield a sword in this dream. Okay, so combat time. Uh, the timeline shows who will act next. Oh, I see. Oh, okay. Okay, it's turn-based combat. Okay. Uh, I guess that's Slash. And he's going to attack back. Oh no, my crown! Oh, I'll put it back on. All good. I guess I'll just keep using Slash for now. Okay, that was pretty easy. 50 XP! Well, I have a sword now, so that's cool. Her father. How much father? Aurora, what is a father? That is simple. I am his daughter. Do you know what a daughter is? <laughs> Oops. Okie doke. Slow foes. Hold ZL with over a foe. Okay. So that uses up my, my blue bar like that. And it lets me catch up. Oh, I see. That's clever. Nice. I like that. That's a cool gimmick. Uh, level up. 
Ding, 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 ding. So it's using like a, a real-time battle system thingy, like in, like in the newer Final Fantasies, but like, well, not the newer ones, like Final Fantasy VII, for example, or Chrono Trigger, but you can actually control the timing with real-time tricks, which is pretty cool. Uh, let's see, what do I want? I reckon I want Starlight. There we go. Right, the old monastery. Okay, we're still going to the monastery. Surprise strike, attack from behind. Can I attack on this screen? I don't have a sword. I guess if I just walk up to the enemy from behind, it'll work? I don't know. Like that? Surprise strike, it worked. Okay, cool. Yay! Healing tonic. Delicious. Oh, there's two of them. I don't think Starlight can hit more than one enemy at a time, so I guess I'll just attack one. And slow the other one? I'll wait for it to... There we go. Which skill should I buy next? I reckon this other spell is probably a good choice. For the time being, anyway. Okay, I can't reach the top of that tree. So let's keep going. I feel like we're having some frame rate issues, maybe? Magic potion. Sounds exciting. Hmm. Just want to push this box along. I don't know why. Oh, so I can climb up here. That's right. That makes sense. Okay, 
Okay, yeah, you can stun enemies by shining the light at them, which is handy. Level four. Gives me another skill point, so I can spend that on something. Okay, all of these are just uh, MP upgrades and stuff. There's no more basic skills available on any of these parts right now. So let's see. Defend. What's down here? Counter attack. That sounds cool. I like that. Let's go this way. How do I get that chest over there? It looks pretty far. Oh, I can just do that. Okay, um... Voices because I don't know who that is talking. Also, I'm bad at voices. Hello, bird. Oh, oh. Don't they know? Rocks planted in the ground will not grow. Why did you plant a rock? <laughs> it's not going to do anything. And some mushrooms. I think we are having some frame rate issues here. Hello. Oh, you're an enemy? Alright. Interrupt the throws by hitting them while they are casting. Okay, that's interesting. Can I, like, wait until it's their turn so I can do that? Spooky place? No other choice. Whoa, that was scary. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Ambush, you're not kidding. Ah! Oh heck, I can get interrupted as well. That's not good. Yeah. 
take out this guy, but still die in one hit. I don't have less to worry about. There we go. Critical hit. That was close. Firefly elixir. I'm guessing that fills up my firefly bar or whatever. Yeah, it does. the only way I can go. Oh, maybe you can go up there? Yes. I was vulnerable to magic. Level five. Um, I want to get the counter attack, so I guess I'll keep going this way for the moment. is blocked. How do we get it unlocked? Probably that switch up there. Yeah. Okay, we're coming up on about about 30 minutes of video, so I guess I'll start giving thought. This game is gorgeous. Um, these are some really, really nice visuals. Uh, I don't... I, I like the um, combat mechanics. They're very uh, in depth. I, I would say would be a good word. And I like. I, I feel like the Firefly would be a bit better with more options to control it. Like I feel like I should be able to point with my Joy-Con. I know that there isn't a real IR sensor, like there was on the Wii. So you have to be just using the motion, but. A lot of um, Switch games do that, and it works pretty well, in my opinion. It would be nice to have that as an option. Um, it wouldn't be good to have that as the only way, because I know a lot of people would be annoyed by that. But, as an option, it would be nice. The visuals still strike me as a bit strange to have this three, this one 3D model when everything else is like hand-drawn 2D sprites. I assume it's meant to be like, she doesn't really belong here, uh, and it sort of works that way, but it does look weird. Uh... How on earth do we travel up high? Wish you could fly. Aurora, illuminate the oculi. Let me try. Okay, so was that thing the oculi? Oculus? What do you think they roast in these vats? 
Hopefully not children. Oh no, what if it's cats? This one pulls all the way over here. One of them to this one. The um, rhyming scheme thing is a little cheesy, in my opinion. Um, I mean, I know why they're doing it, but it, it feels a little forced. What's this switch do? Oh, cool. Oh, okay, we've got a bit of, a bit of puzzle here. Uh, we have to go get one of these crates. Bring it over here. Oops. Alright, so yeah, uh, that's Child of Light. And a sort of side-scrolling platformer RPG kind of thing, which looks pretty good to me. Uh, I like it. I think it looks like a fun game, and I'm going to enjoy it. Uh... I still think it looks a bit strange to have one 3D model in this, like, beautifully hand-drawn wor hand world, but I feel like they've got that, they've done that on purpose, so maybe it's okay. What are doing that? I guess I can get up there later. <laughs> anyway, yeah, uh, that's it for this video, I guess. Uh, thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed. Uh, next time... I'll check out something else. I'll probably look at the other games on this card. Uh, since there's two games on one card and all that. Oh, you can use the touchscreen to control Igniculus. Okay, that makes sense. That's pretty cool. Yeah, I'm, I'm happy with that, actually. That's, that's neat. Apparently Rora has a dash button. I wonder if I have un unlocked the ability to do that yet. I feel like I probably haven't. Anyway, uh, that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, bye! I hope it saved. I don't know when it saves. I think it auto-saves. But I don't know how often. Obviously I've got a save somewhere, so I I'm not going to worry about it right now. <laughs>